All right. Salaamu Alaikum, everybody. Uh, I have uh, nearly two weeks ago, I had a short debate with uh, Muslim Latin uh, about uh, apostasy law. And despite uh, in around 20 minutes uh, discussion with him, I just uh, managed to talk to him a few minutes because mostly he was talking. And uh, anyway, uh, he deleted the entire video from his channel and I wish to uh, record it. So I put that part that I was debating him on my channel. After a few days, he uh, put a copyright strike on my um, video and deleted. Uh, I have, uh, you know, um, failed a complaint to YouTube and I hope that they return it back. <clears throat> but I want to go through this, uh, you know, debate now and see uh, yeah i don't think that he can uh, you know delete it, this one from my channel let's uh, go through that uh, the video let me see uh, let's bring uh, moji uh, let's see what moji is about since <laughs> it's, it's a recommendation from michael so uh, let's see hello hello hi how are you? Have, I, have we have we had a discussion before? No, no. Once I ask you a question, and you remove me right away, okay? Because okay. I ask you a question, a very difficult question. I have to say, from beginning. I don't think it was because I don't think it's because it's a difficult question. But if okay, I removed yes. you, then there must have been a reason why I removed. Okay, you. okay. there was no any reason. You, I just was talking to him. Five seconds. I just wish to say there is a fabricated hadith. It says two verses of Quran has been eaten by a goat. <clears throat> then suddenly he removed me. Okay, so after five seconds, there is no such a reason. He, <clears throat> you know, uh, unjustly uh, accused me for being a Quranist, Quran law, which I'm not. You accuse me for being a Quranist and remove me. I have to say, after, first of all, I'm a great kafir towards your Islam. Okay. So, oh God! Uh, yes, yes, Mike. Why, why that, can't you just? Why can't you bring reasonable people, Mike? <laughs> you always okay. bring. It is not reasonable <clears throat> that I hate that religion that you follow, uh, killing apostates, stoning adulterers. You know, a barbaric religion. So that's reasonable for me. Let Let me. See. All right. Go yes. Ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead, Mister. Let me ask uh, you a question. Moji. Okay. Yeah. Go let ahead, me ask Mr. you a Moji. question. Okay. I'm a former apostate. Okay. And Alhamdulillah, I wasn't killed by you and people like you. And Alhamdulillah, I converted to Islam 10 years later. Okay. okay. And Quran, when, right. Quran says, when Quran says no compulsion in religion, why uh -huh. people like you say that uh, an apostate should get killed? All right. So first, uh, you got to calm down first, right? You got to yes, calm yes. down, chill, okay. make a chill pill, right? That's the first All thing. Right. Second yes. thing is okay, the first thing is that um, you usually remove me. Okay. You guys. All of you, that's why I'm in a hurry to ask my question. The uh, few minutes that I get, okay, finally, after all these years, <clears throat> then I'm very in a hurry, uh, very much in a hurry to ask my question. You can't accuse me of killing someone. You, you don't know me. I don't even know where you are in the world. Okay, but you believe. I know you. I know that you believe in killing apostates. So don't say, I don't know you. I'm you, can you, can you let, look, look, I let you finish what you're saying, right? Okay, yes. Okay. Just calm yeah. down because I don't want to remove yeah. you, right? Okay. I'm letting you now just like do this demonstration of your behavior without removing okay. you. So, so please okay. don't interrupt, right? All right. So I, I don't know who you are. I've never, the first time in my life I've seen you, bro, or talking to you. You said this is the second time or maybe okay. just, you were there for a few seconds. <laughs> why, why am I going to kill you? I'm, look, to tell you the truth, I'm really not interested in you at all. Like the only reason I'm talking to you is because Mike brought you here and you came on the channel, mm -hmm. right? So, I, okay. so you shouldn't have these illusions of grandeur thinking I'm going to go out of my way. To commit a crime and like go to jail by doing something to you okay right okay so that's, okay that, there's a second thing right okay okay that i understand that you are afraid of going to jail otherwise if you were not uh you know uh afraid of that if you had the opportunity you would do that because you believe you know you believe in praying and you pray you believe in fasting so you do fast yeah so you believe in killing apostates so if it it happens if you get the opportunity then you do that now, the third thing I'm, I'm going to say is when you say the Quran says there is no compulsion in religion, mm -hmm. we do not take the Quran in vacuum. Okay. This is how we look at the Quran. You might look at the Quran in vacuum and try to come to your own understanding. We don't do that. Mm -hmm. We believe that this is called, uh, this verse is about acceptance of religion. 
Do you agree with that or do you disagree with that? This verse is about okay. there's no compulsion and acceptance of religion. You cannot force someone to accept Islam. We have okay. no issues with that. So there is a compulsion in religion. <laughs> so the compulsion is not for, according to you, um, for non-Muslim. Uh, I mean, for Muslims, there is a compulsion. And so when Allah says, uh, you know, he has given free will to everybody, all mankind, then you say Allah didn't give the free will to Muslims. It ha he has given free will only to non-Muslims. So once you accept uh, Islam, then uh, you are not free anymore. You don't have that, uh, that free will anymore. And it's not about accepting Islam. You are born in a Muslim family without choosing it. And uh, you are, you know, your free will is gone when you are uh, born in a Muslim family. You don't have free will, according to you. We have okay. no issues with that. Do you disagree okay. with this? I disagree with that. You disagree, so you think we should force people to accept Islam? No, I disagree that you say non-Muslim. I dis I agree that anyone, okay? Because it's a Okay, lie. so uh, no problem. Uh, okay, uh, yes. So 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 uh, here here is what I'm telling you that your your understanding is incorrect, and that's why that's what happens with people like you who, for, okay. for example, have their own understanding of the Quran. You can read the verse and come and make up your own understanding. You can okay. make up your own your own conclusions, and I. Can it's not about your understanding. When Allah says La ilaha illallah. That's also, you cannot say, oh, you have different understanding, okay? Allah doesn't talk about every God, talking about few gods, okay? okay. Say, I'm like you right now, you're not better okay. than me. I read okay. the Quran, and this is how I understand. Why should we take your okay. understanding over my understanding? Everyone okay, can so tell us play this game. No, 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 we, I'm not done, right? All right, okay. So, 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 the point is very simple. Okay. We as Muslims do not take the Quran in a vacuum. Okay. We do not take the Quran in a vacuum. We take the Quran yes. in its historical context and okay. with the explanation of the person who brought it to us, which is the Prophet Muhammad. Mm -hmm. And that's why we look that we have a reason of revelation. If you open the books of uh, Tafsir, the books of exegesis, which, which are uh, 1,200 years before you were born, existed and were written, it mentions that there is a reason for a, a revelation of this verse. And there is a person who came to the Prophet with two of his children, you know, Christian. Okay. And then he said, Shad al forces them to accept Islam. He accepted Islam and they were ch uh, Christian children. And then the Prophet told him not to uh, force them to accept Islam. So we believe this verse is about the acceptance of the religion. Okay. Now, once a person accepts Islam, now there are uh, uh, obligations now of Islam that becomes bound for him. Now, if okay. that person, for example, if that person steals, do you believe there is a punishment of stealing that is mentioned in chapter 5 of the Quran? Uh, do you believe, do you understand, or I probably have your own understanding when the okay. Quran looks to the hands and all of that. So, the point I'm trying to make is this, is there are punishments that... Sorry, um, the thing is that this uh, ridiculous, uh, you know, interpretation is that in Sweden is also, uh, you know, freedom of uh, religion. There is no compulsion in religion in Sweden. But once you are a citizen or put your f uh, foot on... Swedish soil, there are obligation to follow the rules. The rules are that you cannot go and steal or kill people. That's different than believing in something or disbelieving in something. So your argument is, you know, uh, wrong, absolutely wrong. Comes applicable. There are mentioned in the Quran, many of them. Like for example, qisas. Like if you kill someone, you're killed in retribution. That's punishment. Okay. It doesn't matter okay. you accepted Islam or not. You still be forced that that punishment will be applied to you now because the minute you accepted Islam, now the rules of Islam are all applicable to you. So there is no <laughs> contradiction in understanding that verse. So you understand, everybody understand that that's a false, you know, argument. As I said, in every country, uh, f you know, democracy countries, you are also obligated to follow the rules, which is not going around and kill people or steal or such a things. But you can believe in whatever you want. You can, uh, you know, worship any god you want. So what Allah SWT says in the Quran, La ikra haf din, that ha is like la ilaha illallah. Okay, that ha is very important. It's not just there. Okay, is no. Uh, there is no God but Allah. It's absolute. La ikraha fiddin is absolute also. Accepting that verse to mean that it's about making, forcing someone to accept Islam. You don't force anyone to accept Islam. Now, mm -hmm. uh, the second part of it is that if someone were to leave Islam, mm -hmm. the, uh, I have a whole video, two actually videos on my channel. But actually, the last video I uploaded is about this. 
where I go about the conditions, and you're welcome to go watch it because I'm not going to go in repetition back and forth. There are too many conditions that are mm -hmm. supposed to be set in place. person who applies the punishment is the ruler, is not me. No, there's no vision in terms of, oh, you're going to do this to me, oh, alhamdulillah, it's not this like drama you're trying to play. It doesn't exist in Islam because these hudud and punishments are applied by the state. All the hudud are, are applied by the state. They're not applied. But what I meant is that if state asks you to carry on that hudud, that punishment, you you should do that because you believe in that. Okay. By individuals. Don't go do it yourself. Second thing is, is that there is a criteria that the person, how do I know you left Islam? You have to tell me, you have to make it out loud. You have to announce it. And then there is a period of repentance. They bring that person. He asked that person to repent. How many and that can, be, and, and that can uh, be a long? minimum three days, minimum three days. Okay. Like, uh, Maximum. And then and then it can go uh, up to the, the decision of the judge. There are two, over 20 days, 28 days or 26 days, I don't remember, okay. was two of the companions okay. uh, who there was a Jewish person and, and they gave him that long. Okay, so I remember that he said over 26 days, that long, okay? So that's the maximum, according to him. All right, he later changed his words. Okay. Over 20 days. Okay. So over, over 20 days they gave him. So uh, it just depends on the judge. If he sees that that person is accepting, uh, there's acceptance in that person. Uh, it just depends on the individual. Individual, mm -hmm. a minimum three days. So you have that period. And then that person could pretend as if he's a Muslim because he doesn't want to be punished. Okay. He says, okay, he says, okay I'll come back to Islam now. He just pretends and then he lives his life. He leaves the Muslim state, goes somewhere. No one, no one is going to do anything to him. He can say, I'm pretending oh, so to be a Muslim. Can I Nobody's going to punish him. Can I say something? Yes. Uh, okay, yeah. I know you're very eager to speak. I'm just yes. trying to give you the answer first. Okay. <laughs> before, before, before All right. Speak, right? Uh, yes, I understand. Yes. yes. Okay. okay. Now, so you want people to live like Munafirun. Like they are leaving millions of them in the Middle East, okay, who do not believe, but they live like Monafirun. So your religion needs Monafirun, yes? No, to pretend no. to the be answer... Muslim. A lot of things is that. Do you talk a lot? So let me no, say. no, you, you made a, you, you, you asked me a question. You, you see, uh, uh, he has been talking all this time, and now when I want to, you know, talk, he doesn't allow me. I said, do you want people? And then you're going to jump to a different point. Let's go point okay. by point, right? Okay. It's, not, I talk, it's not that I talk a lot, by the way. Okay. It's that you ask a question and that requires answers. So I was answering you. I was not okay. talking uh, irrelevant things, right? Now okay. you said, do you want people to be munafiqun? The response okay. to the question is no, I don't want people to be munafiqun. So, but you force them. You force them and you make them munafiqun by putting a sword on their neck. <clears throat> of course, as I say uh, later, even North Korea, they don't want people to live like munafiqun. <clears throat> but... Uh, in North Korea as well, if you say, I don't want to, uh, you know, believe in Marxism, then they also most likely kill you or put you in jail. So even there, people have to pretend that they believe in Marxism. People to accept the truth. That's the okay. only thing I want. Now, yeah. if someone lives in a Muslim state and he doesn't accept Islam, okay. he's always welcome to leave. There is... Oh my God, <clears throat> such an ignorant. Leave, leave there. If I'm living in Yemen, that I don't even have passport. Even if I have a passport, where to live? My family, everybody is there, you know. My home is there. Where shall I live? Leave to Europe? I can't even cross the, the border. He's sitting in London. <clears throat> He's doing Dawa. He, uh, you know, try to bring people to his radical views. And he enjoying this freedom of speech in London. <clears throat> But in a country like Yemen, he wants that people shut their mouth, okay? Such a hypocrisy. The rules in, in that Muslim state, right? There's government okay. rules, Sharia rules. One of them okay. is that to do with apostasy. Let's say someone, you said, I don't want him to be a monafiq, let him leave, go somewhere else. Why? You don't have to be here. If you okay. have issues with the Islamic rules in an Islamic state, you don't have okay. to live in that Islamic state. You can go. And that's why you will see at the time of the Prophet ﷺ, when he had the Sokhah of Qudaybiyah, for example, you had the disbelievers, the people who apostated, they were, uh, the Prophet sent them back to, to Quraysh. Okay, the difference is that, you know, why he didn't kill them, first of all. And then even he sent them to Quraysh. It's just, <laughs> it was 1400 years ago. There was no any visa, a passport, and so on. And then <clears throat> it was just, two different uh, cities. From one city, they were actually from uh, Mecca themselves, okay? So they came with the prophet, okay, you don't want to be here anymore. Yeah, you are free to go.
So they went back to, to their home. That's all. That's that's not a big deal. But the big deal is that if I live in Yemen or Saudi Arabia, and <clears throat> I don't want to leave my family, my relative, my home country, even if I want to do that, where shall I go? There is no any uh, you know place to go. I have to come to Europe. How can I come to Europe? I don't get get even visa. Even if I come with visa, how can I stay in Europe? So don't think that it is that easy that you you know think that go. Okay. So about them being Munafiqun, they, they apostated and they let them go back. Okay. Okay. So you want to go back? Go, they, they go back. That was the, one of the rules of the treaty. Of Al okay. And there are scholars who say, based on that, we can do the same thing. So okay. if someone wants to leave, they can leave. They can pretend okay. they say, I was not leave. Nobody is forcing you, nobody's forcing you to stay. But the minute if you they stay, they don't want to leave. If I'm they coming don't to want that. To leave. Yes. I'm coming to that. Okay. Be patient, right? But I have to ask you a question. You know, you're talking all the time. Relax. As I said to you at the beginning, no, of the I'm conversation. asking a question. I'm asking yes, a question. It's, but it's very, uh, you know, yes. uh, passionate. So take okay. a, a little bit down, right? So if okay. someone doesn't want to leave, then they leave without breaking the rules. Okay, so Monafaru. Leave like Monafaru. <clears throat> One of these okay. laws is you cannot go around preaching to people disbelief that you left Islam okay. and I'm no longer Muslim. Mm -hmm. Welcome to live, live, don't leave, but live okay. your life, do whatever you want to do, but don't go around to the people saying to the mm -hmm. people, I left Islam, leave Islam, Islam is wrong, and all of this stuff, like many mm -hmm. people do today. So they can live under that. Say, for example, at the time of the Prophet, you had what you called yourself Munafiqun there, and the Prophet knew them by the way, he knew that they were Munafiqun, but he yes. said, not punish them. Okay, yeah. Because they lived in harmony in the society, they did not cause division. They were not there trying to cause tr trouble and saying, we're not going to follow the rules and this and that. Okay. Yeah. Okay, now my question is that in North Korea, okay, if you leave Marxism, okay, okay. You, you have to also keep it inside yourself. If you openly, for example, if you convert someone to Islam, that person has no right to go around and say that I'm a Muslim and I want to convert other people. They also get killed, okay, in North Korea. So you want to tell me, the most merciful and forgiving God has the same law as as North Korea. And Quran says in chapter No, no, wait. Four, Before we go to the Quran, let's go to the North Korea first. You said okay, North Korea. Yes. Now, yes. now that is an absurd example because okay. I don't know if you were listening or not. I was listening. Respond, okay, if you were listening, you would have known everything I just said about the period okay. of repentance, a person choosing to be punished, a person leaving, all of this stuff. Does not everything you said, it, it is exactly the same in North Korea, okay? I was listening to your, you know, your ridiculous explanation. Islam, then straight away they're going to be... Nobody says that. That's your understanding that I've just explained to you how it was flawed, but you're okay. still trying to compare it to North Korea, which has a completely different thing. It has, is it relevant to what we're talking about? It is the same. They also say you... So North Korea say, says that... Say also that you... Okay, go ahead. You, North Korea is the same. Okay, don't lie because even there you repent, they will forgive you okay uh, if you say no 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 i'm a marxist i love karl marx they will not kill you and make it up your own okay. rule as if wait wait as if i said if just someone leaves islam then straight away they're gonna be nobody says that that's your it doesn't matter you give them 20 days 26 days or three days okay it doesn't matter understanding that i've just explained to you how it was flawed but you're okay. still trying to compare it to north korea which has a completely different thing it has is it relevant to what we're talking about it is the same. They also say you. So North Korea say, are, says that. Say also that you. Okay, go ahead. Say, you, sure, yeah, sure. It says if you disbelieve in Marxism, you have. Uh -huh. If you become a Muslim, okay, yes. and you want to preach Islam in North Korea, yes. okay, yes. They, you get also either go to jail or you get killed in North Korea. That, that's not the same thing. Again, you're making another false, it false is the comparison. Same thing. It if is the you same accept. Thing. No, 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 no. An atheist, like leaving Islam and becoming an atheist, for example. Or, or it's not preaching another ideology. You just left. You're telling people no longer do not follow that. Now, I said to you, what are the conditions that I said to you because you're claiming it is the same? What are the same mm -hmm. things that I said to you that are, are going to happen if someone leaves or apostates? What are the necessary things that I just told you for punishment? Go ahead. Tell me what they are. Uh, you said that you give, I don't know, 20 days, okay, or maximum, which took me 10 years. Myself, 10 years. I didn't say I, I didn't say maximum 20. You yeah, clearly you were not paying attention. You said three months, three months, maximum. I didn't months. say. No, I, I, the three months was the, uh, I, I don't remember, but he said over 26 days. Three months, maximum. I didn't say, months. I didn't say three months. Do you see, okay. this is my problem. Uh, okay, how long? Now, now say it. How long? Look, look. look how long this is the maximum? 
let me speak, right? Okay, yeah, please. How this is my problem, months? and Mike okay. is not here, sadly, because I wanted to make this point to him. I don't know if he's okay. here or not. But this is the problem of why I don't speak to individuals like you. Like, okay. the reason I removed you last time, it was not because, oh, I was scared of you. Here, you asked your question, and I responded. The no. reason was is because you don't pay attention to it. No, the reason was <clears throat> that you, after five seconds, you removed me, okay? So last time, I didn't talk to you at all. I just reached to five seconds to ask you, question there is a hadith that says two verses of quran has been eaten by a goat and then you remove me you said oh this guy is a <clears throat> hadith rejecter the other person is saying no you, i heard like, like i'm paying very close attention to what you're saying i can tell you everything you said from the beginning okay. you enter the conversation until right now right i can tell you everything uh, verses you mentioned the arguments you made i can tell you okay for everybody else can go also back and listen how how he said it he said over 26 days okay that long uh, it took uh, somebody uh, that the companion, I think he said, gave, you know, over 26 days. Now okay. you're not listening because I, I, I listen. Very, uh, I again, can tell you, I can tell you. Can Let I me say just now? finish. Just say, can, can I, I say can I finish? You said. Can I finish? Can I I'm just say saying? everything you said. No, 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 you, want, you can't. Okay. No, you, do you know why you can't? Because you, you just made a mistake. I asked you, I give you a chance. And then you said okay. uh, 20 days maximum, three months. That's what you said. And I didn't say okay. any of that. Okay. I said minimum three days. Okay. Maximum yes. can go more than 20 days and can be up to the individual if the judge sees, for example, okay. this person is. Ex That's what I said. So it's not like that. Okay. You're, you're not paying attention to okay. it. Okay. When you say maximum over 20 days, okay. What does, does that mean? Okay. Maximum over 20 days. So that's the maximum. Okay. Over 20 days. Why you don't say maximum until you leave? Okay. Why you don't say maximum 10 years? of 20 years this shouldn't be maximum if you have the right to you know to convert whenever you uh, understand it okay like i did it it took me 10 years somebody's somebody may take for somebody 20 years okay you shouldn't put maximum you set maximum over 20 20 days 26 even you said what i'm saying is the problem. Okay, how, okay can i can you say how long is the maximum please I just ex uh, responded to you. It can be individual based. Let's say you are accepting. Let's say, for example, I'm talking to you now for 10, uh, 10 20, 30, 40 days. And I can okay. see that you're listening. I can see it's, okay. it's having an influence. Okay. First of all, if you put a sword over my neck, okay, then you don't need to talk to me 20, 30 days. <clears throat> you just need to talk to me five seconds. Okay. You say, if you do not accept, we kill you. Okay. After five seconds, if I am wise enough, I would say, yeah, 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 I accept, okay? So the way you ask, definitely, it doesn't take 20 days or over 20 days, all right? But if you give the freedom to person, might take over 20 days, might take over 20 years, okay? If you say, no, no, we are not going to harm you. You just, we are going just to, to explain for you. We are going to, you know, guide you, all right? And there is no any punishment for you. The punishment is hereafter as it is in the Quran. Than you then okay. there's more time there's more time giving because i can okay. see there is an effect positive effect taking place can you so, take 10 years there, there is no text there is no text there is no text that mm -hmm. makes a specific limit for it but okay. i've told you that person has a way out always to say no uh, i'm okay. a muslim now there's okay. no punishment that would be applied to him he's no okay. longer going to be punished by the everybody understand that uh, that would happen that's that's obvious okay that if you uh, are forced to accept okay then uh, and you say that i accept yes definitely i understand that you are not going to punish that person okay but the the important part here is that you have no right to punish people okay for their like uh, rahaf din is that there is no any compulsion in religion whatsoever state and he okay. can leave in north korea you cannot do that my friend in north korea okay. the minute you say anything against uh, the state, you're punished straight away. There's no questions asked. There's no period of repentance. There's no, oh, okay. come back to this. There is no, you have a, ch a chance to say, okay, I believe now and leave the state and <laughs> go somewhere else. Your example is clearly incorrect. And there is, it's a okay. false comparison. These are two separate things. Okay. So please, please, when I speak, pay attention to the points I'm making because they're very important. And they are responding to you. And we don't okay. want to keep going in a circle. Okay, so you are better than North Korea a little bit. You allow them to leave, okay? But North Korea doesn't allow them to leave according to you, okay, I don't know. But whatever, you are not that better than North Korea, okay? And we don't okay. want to keep going in a circle and say things okay. which are incorrect because you're not paying attention. Okay, can we go to 
Quran now. About okay. from verses of Quran. Can we go to that? All right, all right. Let, let's have a quick. Let's have a quick. Uh, see what, what what verse you want to bring quickly, okay. because there are many people in the backstage. All, all right. right, go ahead. What, okay. what is the? There are many verses. One of them is four one hundred thirty-seven. Indeed, those who have believed then became kafir. Then believed, then became kafir, and then increased in kafir. Never will Allah forgive them, nor will He guide them uh, to the. Um, uh, to the way, okay? So, in this verse, <clears throat> there were people who disbelieved uh, or became kafir, then they believed. If their punishment was death, then they wouldn't be able to believe again. And then, finally, their punishment... Wait, 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 relax, yeah. relax. He doesn't even allow me to read the Quran uh, verse and then explain it, what I want to say. Wait, wait, wait. I'm going to tell you what the Quran says. The punishment is hereafter. Calm down. Okay, I don't. No, I'm, I'm just. No, you're very. That, yeah? Take your time when you're speaking. Look, I, yes, I'm like, okay. look, you, people need to understand what you're saying, right? Okay. Take your time. All right. So you so, said there is a verse in the Quran. Not that one verse, one verse many, many verses. I know, I know, I know. There's more than one. I read from one. Of you. Amanu thumma kafaru thumma amanu thumma. Okay. I know the verses that you're referring okay. to. So okay. Uh, now, thumma zdadu kufran lan tuqbala tabatu. I don't. I don't think you speak Arabic. Do you? Do you? Okay. No, I don't speak Arabic. But sure, I sure. have so made those who believe, those, 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 yeah, who believe and disbelieve, believe and disbelieve, believe and disbelieve, and then their the repentance is go, is not going to be accepted. It doesn't say disbelieve. It says become kafir. Okay. So don't mix that. Kafir doesn't mean disbelieve. All right. That's another topic. Okay. Talking about repentance. Repentance. Okay. Lantukbala Taubatuhum. Tauba is the repentance. Allah is not going to okay. accept the repentance. But now you said if they're killed, but okay. that's not possible. The response yes. to that question is again, you've not paid attention. Why you've not paid attention? Because I said there's something called the period of repentance. Okay. And within that period of repentance, it's possible for someone to say, I come back to Islam. This verse now is talking about the people who will play a game. Okay. When it, when they're brought for repentance, they're going to disbelieve again later. Okay. And then they're going to come back again for repentance. And then they're going to disbelieve again later. This is talking about a very specific type of people. Those people who are trying to play in games. Okay, but anyway, <clears throat> even after they, dis according to you, become kafir, or you say disbelieve, anyway, they are not going to get killed because there is not a single thing is mentioned. Their, uh, what is it? Their punishment is here after in that verse, 4, 137, and says, Allah says, and then increase in cough. <clears throat> Never will Allah forgive them, nor He will guide them to the to a way. Okay, so He's not going to guide them. <clears throat> Understand? And <clears throat> chapter sixteen, verse one hundred six. Whoever reject Allah after his belief, except for one who is forced <clears throat> to renounce his religion while his heart is secure in faith. But those who willingly open their <clears throat> breasts to cough, they will be condemned by Allah and suffer a term, uh, sorry, ter tremendous punishment. So the punishment is hereafter. <clears throat> Chapter 2, verse one, uh, 217. And whoever of you revert from his religion and dies as a kafir. Look here, Allah doesn't say get killed. It says, and dies a natural death <clears throat> as a copper for those their deeds have become worthless in this world and in the hereafter and those are the companion of the fire they will ab uh, abide therein in eternally so even here it is a natural death and the punishment is hereafter chapter 5 verse 54 chapter 47 verse 38 Chapter 3, verse 86 to 89. Chapter 3, verse 90. Chapter 3, verse 91. Chapter 16, verse 61. So all these verses uh, of the Quran, they talk about apostasy and not a singular of them, Allah says, uh, kill them. Okay, But uh, on opposite side, there are many, many um, verses that, uh, you know, Allah says that Oh, Muhammad, you just invite. You are not a controller over them. And you see, uh, he also has changed my name from Perfect Dawa to Angry Dawa. People, those people who are trying to play in gay, a game with their belief and faith that Allah is not going to accept their repentance. So if you paid okay. attention to the criteria I gave you, you'll see there's no contradictions. The contradiction is only in your understanding. Okay. Uh, look, uh, I was uh, listening to Dr. Uh, I forgot his name. He said, La Wait, wait. 
La ikraha fiddin is like la ilaha illallah. There is no condition in that which you put, okay, that it is for non Muslim. When it comes that ha, la ilaha, is absolute. La ikraha is absolute, which you guys take a condition for that which Allah says there is no condition. You cannot say for Muslims. Uh, somebody who is born in a Muslim family, which hasn't learned it, doesn't know anything about it. If you want to le leave, then you have to, you know, force that person by putting in prison, you know, then uh, put a, a, a sword on his neck that if you don't believe. Sure, we don't, we don't believe in that. I've already yeah, responded to that. So I'm not going to. Okay. And no, so, again, again, no, 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 without so I got to respond to what you said. Okay. So I'm not interested in doctor, you know, who that you don't know his name, who okay. said whatever. I don't know who that person is. I'm not interested in what he has to say. Okay. I responded to you very clearly and very easily and very simply. Mm -hmm. I told you the answer to the understanding of the verses of the Quran is based on the, the context of the verses okay. of the Quran. Right. No, 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 you're not. Okay. What did I just say? Uh, you said that uh, we have to. Uh, no, no. The last thing I said. The last thing I said. Okay. About the Quran, Quran verses you said. What yeah. did I say? You said that you have to uh, understand the verses of Quran. Yes. Okay. What do we need to understand the verses? What did I say? What, what do you need? Okay. Then pay attention, please, because you look okay. left and right everywhere. I okay. said you need, for us, the way we understand the Quran, again, I'm going to repeat it to you for one more mm -hmm. time. The okay. way we understand the Quran is through the person who brought the, down, the, brought the Quran to us, which is the Prophet Muhammad and the mm -hmm. historical context of the revelation okay. of these verses. Right. Now, the problem, or problem with you and Dr. I don't know who is that they're not doing that. Now, and the problem is, uh, the, the second problem is if we follow your understanding and Dr. I don't know who, we will fall into contradiction. Now, yeah. please pay attention. You're doing research, uh, you're searching something. No. Now, if I, I say La Ikraha, that. wait, wait, wait. If I say La Ikraha is general, okay, I, and you don't understand Arabic, so I'll, I'll try to okay. explain to you. La okay. means what? What does La mean? No. Yeah, there is no. Ikraha okay. means what? Uh, force. Force. So there is no forcing in mm. Deen. What is it? Okay. Fit Deen. What is it? Yeah. Deen. What does the word Deen mean? Deen is, uh, according to my understanding, in law. According to your understanding. Okay. No, no, so, no. It's, so, it's, it's, so it's the laws of religion, right? Surat okay, so wait, 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 wait. relax, bro. Relax. No, but you said relax. according to my I don't mind. This, this, that's what you said. No, I know, but I say that there is a okay, verse so in relax. Quran, so a relax. Surah Yusuf, that says Halas, relax, the yeah. law of king, yes. The law of king, use it. Yes, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. the, the word, uh, you need to understand one thing, that there are words in the Arabic language that can okay. have multiple meanings depending on the context. Okay. Yes, exactly. So to, bring it, so to bring it in the context of Surah Yusuf does not mean it's the same meaning in Surah Al-Baqarah. You did not prove okay. a point there by saying, okay. oh, Surah Yusuf, right? So uh, okay. that's responding what you were just saying. But let's accept, no problem. It's talking about okay. the laws, right? Let's accept okay. what you say. So mm -hmm. there is no compulsion in the laws, the application of the laws, essentially, in the laws of Islam. That's okay. Saying, right? no, no, yes. Okay. There is no compulsion. When Allah... Okay. So... The verses of the Quran that says, if someone kills someone, mm -hmm. then they should be killed in, in retribution. Uh, mm -hmm. And he doesn't want to be killed. Can that punishment okay. be forced on him? Yes or no? It is trash again, I said. It is the same in Sudan. If you kill someone, uh, the punishment would be applied on you in Sudan, but there is no compulsion in religion in Sudan, okay? Yeah, that's the, uh, you know, the law, what I mean is the, to accept the God's, uh -huh. uh, you know, revelation, uh -huh. okay? Yes. Uh, uh, no, so now, wait, 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 because as I said, and I say again, in democratic countries, there is no compulsion in religion, okay? But you cannot go around and kill people. Okay, that's so totally different. You ignore it. When I caught you and showed you how ridiculous the understanding will be if it was mm -hmm. about the application of the law, because the Quran is full of punishment. Okay, uh, meaning yes. it's mentioning, mentioning verses about punishment. For example, okay. lashing. That okay, lashing yes. is going to be forced. It's not, you're not going to ask the person, oh, do you want to be lashed when you committed, okay. when you did this crime? That's not going to be there. That punishment no. will be applied, yes. whether they like it or not. So ikrah is going to happen. So okay. When we take your flawed understanding, and I, doctor, I don't know who's understanding, we end up finding. Doctor Shabir, Doctor Shabir. Wait, 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 now wait, I, anyways, don't know I don't know who, whoever he is. No, yeah. Okay, you are lying because Doctor Shabir Ali, everybody knows him. No, doctor, you don't. Know don't doctor Shabir. Doctor Shabir, is, you don't know. The point I'm making to you is irrelevant to that person. Okay. 
All right. So, so the you point I'm making, the point I'm making is, if we were to take the incorrect understanding, we mm -hmm. fall into contradiction, and that's okay. why we understand that this is not talking generally about everything in religion. It's not talking about after the acceptance. Mm -hmm. It's referring to the acceptance of the religion itself. If someone mm -hmm. were not accepting the religion of Islam before, that you cannot force them to accept Islam. You see, now when we take things in a, in a historical context. And we take the tafsir and we take the reasons of revelation, explanation of the prophet, everything falls into line. And we don't have these contradictions that you're falling into. Now you're Googling mm -hmm. something else. Look, I no, said to you, you know, that I was, didn't do that. No, do you know why? You're, you're searching somebody for something changed, now. No, somebody, search, changed, yes. no, somebody changed my name to Angry yes. Dawa. No, no, I changed your name. Nobody else has uh, that that's authority. Not right. okay, okay. That's, that has. That's, no, no, but you, you had a different name and then you changed it. I don't agree with perfect. Yeah, that. I don't no. think this is perfect. I don't think. I don't think being the way you are okay. interacting with me right now is perfect. That. So I think the name is incorrect. Uh, okay. Anyways, okay. Anyways, you 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 changed it back. Now look, I've okay. responded to your your question uh, and and uh, responded to the two points or three points that you made. So, Lisi, okay. I have no issues So, uh, one, one question, no, one question. No, no, there no, are, there you there believe, other... no, no. Do you believe yes. that I should have been killed when I up, uh, became apostate? Do you believe no. that I should have been killed? No, no. I believe the criteria that I told you in, in, in this whole conversation should okay. have been apply, applied to you. And if you okay. were brought, and if you okay. were brought, listen, if you if you were in Islamic State, you would have been okay. brought to someone, okay. you would have been brought to someone of expertise. That okay. period of repentance happens with people of expertise. You have clarified issues for you. It would not okay. have taken you 10 years because you would have went to the right person, asked okay. the right question and got the If I went to the wrong person, <laughs> you know, and uh, your right person is a uh, Taliban with a uh, turban, this much beard, you know, that's the right person for you, uh, a bunch of barbarians. Right answers. So no, I don't okay. believe that this should have happened to you. I believe okay. that the Islamic law, the right way, the right application, the right understanding, not the understanding that you have that is flawed of it, mm. should have been applied, right? All right, okay. uh, Mr. Uh, okay. I don't know, you change your name, Muji. <laughs> okay, no problem. No, Anyways, yeah. we had a discussion, we had a talk. It's just like, bye, have, this is a recommendation of Mike. But, but, so I'm okay. just, this is the can, only reason I brought you. <laughs> can I ask a question? If I have other question and discussion with you, can I come back and talk to you or you remove me? Like, yeah, that's fine, but that's fine. But let's have, as I said to you, let's have a calm discussion. Let's have a okay, I, uh, that's all. Thank you for watching this video. Please share it if uh, you can uh, so that uh, everybody see that Muslim Latin didn't want that this video uh, be on online. He deleted. Thank you very much. And uh, inshallah, we will fight these uh, extremists.